Hello and welcome back to the Forgotten City and today we will uh, check out those catacombs oh, like that maybe I should walk with people after all friend of the philosopher this must be one of the philosopher's f eleven friends who he outlined not lived There's another one. And one and there were a lot of them. Just checking. There's nothing hidden. Okay, there are arrows. It seems to, to be locked from the other side, of course. who are al half alive, I think. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I can see one moving over there. Don't I'm paranoid. Be serious. I hate those sounds. Egyptian plaque, with, which translates to The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Board for an ancient game called the Senate, the rules for the long forgotten. We're going to meet Anubis. Oh, really? So you were the one making all that noise. That should be all of them. And yeah, it's the same. And this is an abyss. So I guess it doesn't matter what religion we're talking about. That is always the same. And you're alive! Is 
Stop! Do not come any closer. Who are you? I'm Ethna. Who are you? I am Kabash. Oh, is he? Hmm. And let me guess. Another Greek or Roman come to loot and plunder the resting place of my ancestors. Hmm? I'm just looking for an Egyptian plaque. Or do I look... Hmm, do I look like Greek or Roman? Hmm. Trousers, boots, curious here. No, I suppose you do not. Then what do you want? I'm just looking for an Egyptian plaque. Hmm. To what end? I won't return it to the obelisk. Hmm. That is welcome news. You really are not Greek or Roman, are you? I was planning to return it myself, but for now, I must remain. Here, take it and restore the honor of Osiris. Okay, thank you. That, uh, that was a little too easy. Now, as for the other plaque. The fourth one? You know about that? Indeed, I have it right here. I stumbled across a collection of dusty curiosities while searching for a place to hide from the hungry children of Amit. And there it was. May I have it? You may not. Mm. In fact, I am about to destroy it. Why? Because it speaks a treacherous, blasphemous lie. How so? I will tell you. But first, do you know what this place is? They do what? Indeed. And I see you know our history. This is the Duat. See what has become of it. I have been down here for weeks, piecing together its story. And here is what I have learned. As Egypt declined and the Greeks had their turn to flourish, their souls came here in great numbers. But instead of adopting our ways, they copied and corrupted them. When they found the obelisk bearing the name Osiris, the true god of the underworld, they desecrated it, removing his name and replacing it with <sighs> Hades. Even the ferryman of the dead, known to my people long before as Kerti, they renamed to Keron. As if that desecration was not enough, they built over this place using it as the foundation for their own underworld so that ours was forgotten. Hmm, <laughs> my only solace is that the Greeks then suffered the same fate when the Romans rose to power, renaming Hades to Pluto, and the cycle began anew. So what's the problem with this plaque? It is inscribed with a script I do not recognize, but it is ancient Almost as if it is older than the plaque bearing Osiris's name. But if that is so, it would imply the gods of Egypt are mere imitations too, copied and corrupted from an ancient people who prospered even before us, and that my people did to them what the Greeks and Romans did to us. <laughs> but this I cannot accept. I sense a deception. Perhaps it is the work of Set, the usurper, seeking to undermine Osiris once more. What does the inscription say? You will never know. Oh god damn it, come on! This work of sacrilege must be destroyed, thrown into the black abyss below in Osiris's name. Somebody need that! You are too late. Oh god damn it. It is done. I wish you hadn't. Now I'm going to have to go in after it. You would plunge into the depths of the Duat with no way back up. Madness. We'll see. But first I have some questions. If it will help you to see reason, then ask. What's your story? I am from Rakotis, which you may know as Alexandria, the name of the city the Greeks built over it. I was a fisherman like my father before me. Since the Romans had taken over from the Greeks, I took the opportunity to learn Latin and eventually traveled to Rome. When the fires broke out last year, 
I tried to help. I gathered terrified locals into my boat and led many of them to safety farther along the Tiber. On my seventh trip, the passenger demanded I wait for his brother. But we were full to almost sinking, and smoke was all around us. I told him his brother would have to save himself, and he tried to bribe me by placing a coin into my hand. When I refused, he drew a dagger and thrust it between my ribs. I awoke on the banks of the river to a stranger wearing a ram headdress. He said his name was Kirti, and at the time I simply thought him odd. It did not dawn on me until much later that he was THE Kirti, the ram-headed ferryman described in the Book of the Dead. Do you know a way out of here? This is where I belong, as caretaker of the memories of my people. If our ways are to be remembered, it falls to me. What do you think about the Golden Rule? I think if someone is to break the Golden Rule, it will not be me, for I try to live as I always have by the command of the goddess Ma'at. Do to the doer to make him do. As for the punishment that will come from it, I finally understand why it has long been said among my people that gold is the skin of the gods. What do you think is down there? I do not know. What could possibly lie beneath the underworld? Perhaps it is infinite darkness. Perhaps it is the lair of Amit, the devourer of souls. All I know is, it would be unwise to venture down there. Uh, perhaps. Most unwise. Okay, so I'm gonna say. Good. Be gone from this place. Wait. You are planning to go down there. I told you so. I, see it in your eyes. I have to go down there. Definitely. You would plunge into the depths of the Duat with no way back up. Madness. I'll find a way back up. Hmm. We shall see. I notice it's safe, but I don't trust it. University. Oh. Okay, here we go. I wonder what's even older. Religion. Okay, I guess the bow is giving me some light. Won't be the Babylon even older? Oops, no. Nope. Stranger, heed the final words of Namkuzu. Bear witness to our aftermath and lament us. We did our best to live as the gods commanded. We planted and harvested together. We shared bread and beer. We accepted newcomers with open arms as a family. But with each newcomer, the bonds of our family strained, and soon we were as strangers to each other. And when those bonds were finally broken, my brothers and sisters planted only for themselves and ate and drank alone. And it was there and it was there, in the empty space between us, that seemed to crude. Nurgle sentinels have awoken, and a clamor at our barricades learned from our mis... Well, I guess mistakes. A yeah, court blast plate with Sumerian markings on it. There is to be pressure for some kind of trap. Yeah! Now that you said it... I can't get inside there. I tried to go in here and I couldn't. I 
can go over there. Please don't stab me in the back. I have a really bad feeling about that. When I told you that you would not find a way back up, that was not a prediction. I hate that you. Was a promise. You will die here. There, w there's no need to end this in violence. I disagree. I warned you against coming down here, against perpetuating this sacrilege, but you persisted. You have undermined and dishonored the true god of the underworld. How did you think this would end, if not with bloodshed? Just hear me out. Very well, I will listen. But if I sense deception, or if you further insult my gods, I will carry out my threat. So tell me, why should I let you live after you salvaged this instrument of blasphemy? Mm. I'm just trying to replace all the plaques taken from the desecrated obelisk. Why? To what end? I'm hoping it will earn me an audience with the god of the underworld. But why? What business could you have with Osiris? I'm going to confront him about the golden rule. Blasphemous fool! Eesh. You have sealed your own fate. Uh. Wait, if you attack me, you'll break the golden rule. Ha, good. I welcome it. You see, the philosopher told me that each time it breaks, Osiris bellows with rage, and his voice shakes the very foundations of the earth. I can only hope one more tremor will lay waste to this fragile place once and for all, and you along with it. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. Okay, oh, 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 oh I died. I got blocked, come on. Okay. Let's, uh, let's load up the save. And um, this time we have to lie. When I told you that that what you would uh there's no need for violence, did. just hear me out. Why? I'm just trying to replace all the plaques, so I'm hoping to an audience. What? I'm going to demand that he let everyone go. I'm going to pay him my respects. Doubtful. Mm. What do you know about honoring the Lord of Silence? Uh, nothing really, but does anyone really know much about him? Hmm. You speak the truth. Indeed, it seems we have all been deceived. Many of my ancestors endured great hardship to live good lives so that we may descend to the Duat in death and be judged accordingly. We prepare to have our hearts weighed on Anubis's scales and to swear ourselves innocent of sin before the 42 assessors of Ma'at. And yet, I arrive here to find the Book of the Dead contained only a seed of truth. And now, I ask myself, did our priests steal and embellish the stories of an older people and feed us lies all our lives simply to trick us into obedience? <laughs> Isn't being a good person a worthwhile pursuit? In in and of itself. I am not sure I follow. Speak plainly. Yeah. 
Even if your beliefs about the afterlife weren't quite accurate, isn't the important thing they motivated you to live good lives? Hmm. Perhaps there is some truth in that. What is your point? Are you going to abandon a lifetime of growth character now that it matters most just because you found out you were misled? Hmm. You are persuasive. Very Thank well. you. <laughs> I will let you live, and you may do what you will with that plaque. I will remain here for a while and attempt to learn what I can about the foundations of my people's beliefs. Go. Thank you. Why I keep doing that? Why is it trapped all over the place? Yeah, there was... Oh, there was a way for me to get this plug quickly. And the plug? You again. What is it now? Okay. Of course. As the Roma... Oh my god. Oh my god. It's... Yep, I did it. Um, hurry. I don't remember picking up. Do we have? No, we don't have it. After all. Give me a second. Okay, we have the ancient one. Oh, this is the ancient one. No. We have some. We have some. Around. Okay. We have Egyptian. We have Roman. We only need the Greek one. Oh, I'm sorry, old man. I think your cave is gonna flood. Uh, on the other hand, I found a bitch. Again, friend, did you find what you need? I enjoyed our chat. <laughs> All right. Wait, how can I get the green? Your plaque. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, what's your story? Never mind uh, then. Huh. Did we? You mean? Back then, it I, I said so. I re as you okay. Why? The Greek flag. I wish I should just start picking by asking George. Is this the only Greek? All right. I know it's right there. Why can't I take one of those? Oh. Actually, it's interesting that there's a couple of Greek play plaques that say the same. But we'll ask Dali, we'll ask Georgius. Oh, we talked. Oh. Maybe I haven't talked to him after I had to load up the game. That mm. might be the case. Mm. Okay, we'll talk to him again. It will be... Strange if we have to go back into the cave again just because I missed something. Well... Well, I guess we won't do it today because it loads so long. So, for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!